buildings. These buildings here, there's a bunch of them. There's some more down there. This was Riverview Hospital. It was our mental hospital for Vancouver. I remember as a kid about your age, coming here uh, with, with dad, with grandpa. Uh, grandpa used to work here. All I remember when grandpa brought me was it was dark little bit creepy um, but that's all I really remember I remember grandpa telling me lots of stories to see it now as an adult Should be a historical site. Kane was just saying this is historic. These buildings date way, way, way back, and uh, definitely should be restored. Grandpa, my dad, left here in the 90s uh, to start an outreach program. I think he spent 20 years working here, something like that. But um, every time I drive by the place, I've always just been very curious. Because dad never wanted to bring me here. He said it was too creepy, too eerie, and it would haunt me. But I do remember coming here once for a paycheck or something with dad. Um, and yeah, I remember it being very dark and creepy. But I think I was a lot older then. I think I was around Caden's age. Um, I don't, I had, had been older. You see broken windows and everything here. Stuff is boarded up here. It's a broken window. We can look inside. Let's take a look. So one of the big things with the, this place is it is it covered in asbestos. But the architecture on this thing is just so amazing. Did you find a bathroom? Yeah. Let's take a look. The old bathroom. I mean, just look at this. Absolutely gorgeous. Oh. If somebody really had the time, you know, to turn this place into apartments, would be absolutely amazing. These would make some awesome studios. Let's take a look in this one. about this place is there's so many plants around here that are very unique because they brought a lot of plants uh, trees shrubs plants uh, here 
from other different parts of the world. So there's, it's very unique uh, to have a lot of these um, trees. Holy. Um, I can only imagine what it's like uh, in the spring. Well, we're in spring now. But what it's like when everything's in full bloom. Um, here's another cherry tree up here on our right. In full bloom. Wow. I'm going to circle up there again. <laughs> 